Well, shoot, like I said, you know, on this show, we always got to we always got to talk about top five. And, um, you know, you're a corner. You, you seem like you studied the game. You studied the past game and the present, of course. But give us your top five all time corners. We're going to put you on the spot. I want to I want to see what you I wanna see. you can put yourself in there. And as a corner, you, as a corner, if you want, you can put yourself in there. But again, I want to I want to hear your top five corners all time. And you say you can't be wrong because this, this is your opinion. Yeah, this yeah. is your hey, yeah, everybody's hey, entitled. Hey. But of course, you know, of course, prime. You yeah. know, that's everybody. But you know, but um, I'm a big Rod fan, Rod Wood. Oh, yeah, Rod Woodson. You know, Absolutely. that's my set. That's my number two. That's number two. Pittsburgh. Uh, he he could Absolutely. be he could easily be number one. You know, but you know, Absolutely. Uh, I see it as just to go. You know, I see it as in Dion one really kind of identify the, the corner position, you know, mm-hmm. just like Jordan identified the shoot guard position. Right, right. There it is. Uh, so, yeah, so uh, uh, my third one, Ooh, I'm, I'm going Charles. <laughs> C. Wood. Wood. Okay. I go C. Wood, man. The third okay. one. Okay. That's where I go at. And, you know, then, um, then you know, you got, then I go, uh, I either go champ. Mm, this is where it gets I, difficult. I, <laughs> yeah, it's like a gift for that. I go to I go with Champ right now. Okay, sure. okay. Uh, he from the he from where I'm from. That's the Georgia boy. Yeah, that's the Georgia. Okay. Yeah, he from where I'm from, man. He down the road from me, man. That's all we knew. All the Bailey boys. You know, if you ain't talking football, you ain't talking about the ba- you talking about the Baileys for sure. Wow. Okay. okay. So you got you got you got, you got Prime. So who's your last your Wood. last one? C Wood, and and then Charles Woodson, and then Champ Ch- Bailey, Champ Bailey. So now, now you're gonna have to it's gonna be between like a Revis. Somebody. It's, it's Reeve, the best Reeve. man. I, 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 I say the Reeve, the best man corner I ever seen. My eyes personally. You know, okay, okay. Uh, okay, Reeve. I think nobody, I think nobody never did what he did yet. And I still as in just man pressing in this generation, this type of game, this game here, guys are too athletic and he and he not had a lot of Zero mm-hmm. man's out there going crazy. So I give Reef five. Then Sherm. Then Sherm. Oh. Then, then okay, Sherm. Okay. So yeah, Sherm, yeah, Sherm is five and a half. Okay, so T, this is for you then. So, so of course, you being a Jordan fan, it sounds like you watched the, the documentary, right? You watched the doc on the Bulls, right, Slay? Yep. So you remember when Mike uh, when Mike looked at the um, at the iPad when they're talking about Gary Payton, and he just started laughing. He said, I ain't got no problem with the glove, right? right. <laughs> So T, T, off of this list, who do you have no problem with? If you if they're out of this list of five, who do you have no problem with? Right? Dion, Rob Woodson, Charles Woodson, Champ Bailey, Dar- Darrell Remus. Who who you have no problem with out of off this list? You talking about just my opinion? Who for, who for you? Have? Who do you have no problem? Like I said, if you was going up one on one against one of these five, who you got no problem with? You gotta pick one of the five. The e- talking about the easiest or the hardest. The easiest for you to, to beat. Oh, uh, the easiest? Oh, man. Like you said, like like Mike said, he just laughed at it. I ain't got no problem with the glove. <laughs> right. Uh, I mean, I, I, I probably had to say uh, C. Wood. C. Wood. Like, I, 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 get, I get him the business. When he, okay. When he came, okay. okay. <laughs> when, when he came, no, no. You can check, you can check my stats. Check my stats with him. When he came to San Fran, I had like 12 or 190 something. I Ooh. went to... Uh, and then I went to uh, then I went to went to Oakland, and I had like twelve for a hundred and ninety something. Like Ooh. I went to work. Trust me. Go look at. <laughs> say, like you said, trust I got no problem with the glove. It was no, <laughs> trust. Me. And it what it was is just like he said. Like for me, it was motivation because like mm-hmm. I knew coming from a small school and like you yeah. know playing in San Fran, I played under really kind of played under Jerry and JJ, and I had to make a name for myself. So as I became a household name. He you was know, a Heisman year. winner. Right. right. So then, like I said, I knew, like, Charles, I, I mean, I watched him. I saw him, you know, play you Michigan, Rose Bowl. Yeah. You know, he had the rose in his mouth. All this, this, that. So, <laughs> you know, the, the, the pregame that leading up to that week, you know, they got the pregame matchup, this and that. And so it was me and him. So for me mm-hmm. personally, like I said, I didn't really say a whole lot. I just went out there and just did my thing. At the end of the day, Check my stats. Check that box. Boy, I went to check that box. Nigga, I clown. 
I Ooh, love it. I, boy, I, I had it. my ready. <laughs> for me, I knew what I had to bring because Charles is such a great corner. So I knew I had to bring that work with him, work with him every 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 play. You know what I mean? Because I knew, like I said, when you give somebody like that an inch, you know, you give them a little confidence. Then, like I said, they're gonna try to take you out your game. So I just knew with that pressure. I tried to apply that pressure in the run game as well as the pass game. Even like I said, I try to keep everybody keep the DBs on their toes, even when I'm, even if it's the run play, I'm not going to give you any tips that I'm like, oh, I'm taking some plays off. Anybody that played against me, they'll tell you, I'm playing 100% pretty much. If I, if I can breathe, I can play, I'm going to go hard the entire game. 